Today I'm replacing the fuel gauge for this k Outlander 07 model 400. That came with a little dial rotary analog old school setup. All right here's a new one. As you can see you can read that one a lot easier. That one's been worn out, cleaned up, worn out again. So we're just going to pop that one out of there. Try to be careful when you pull it out. Not drop any debris down in there. That's the gasket. It sits right up underneath the shoulder there. We've got the new pump right there. Excuse me, the new dial fuel gauge. And over here, we have the new gasket grommet that'll go down and replace that there. The old one just literally pulls right out of there. All it is is rubber. Might need a flathead screwdriver or a pick tool or something, but just pops right out. That's a new one, as you can see, it's just a rubbery gasket material. We'll just set that one right back in its place. So once it's locked in place, we'll go ahead and set the adjuster. Press that down in there. And there we go. As you can see, we're sitting at about a half tank. Not very accurate compared to newer models, but it works. Gives us an idea anyways. That's all there is to it. Again, just a little rubbery piece. That thing's plastic right there. Pop out the old gauge. And pop out that little rubber gasket. Drop the new gasket in, put the new fuel gauge on, ready to go.